clever one. A couple of weeks ago, Saudi Arabian journalist and prominent critic of the government, Jamal Khashoggi, disappeared. But this wasn't a magic show, and he didn't suddenly reappear on the other side of a stage. It turned out that this was more like the magic trick where they make someone disappear or cut them in two. And it was Saudi spies running this show, so it was less Houdini and more Who Done It. And they've stayed quieter since than that one in Penn and Teller that doesn't say anything. You know, there's two stories being proposed by the sides involved. One is the official Saudi one, in which Jamal enters the embassy in Istanbul, gets into a fist fight, and accidentally gets killed in the process, as you do. Uh, they didn't tell us sooner, apparently, because they were too embarrassed. You know, like in those children's stories where a vase gets broken and everyone learns an important lesson about telling the truth. Except if this is a kid's story, it's more like a twisted version of The Three Little Pigs, where the wolf ends up owning the brick house and feasting in barbecue ribs. There's also the Turkish version of events, mind you, in which uh, private jets land from Riyadh with officials who said about dismembering Jamal with a surgical bone saw, and they have evidence of this in the form of a recording from Jamal's Apple iWatch, which he was wearing at the time. Uh, the Saudi spies presumably went on to sink the Apple Watch to the bottom of the Bosphorus. Whatever happened, and I don't think any of us are in much doubt, I'd rather focus on the fact that this is more a classic example of how one death is a tragedy whilst millions dying is a statistic. Much has been said about the war in Yemen and a criminal justice system that puts ISIS to shame in terms of its brutality. But you can also take a look to the other participants in this. You know, it's 100 years since over a million people went missing in Turkey, except those were Armenians, and Istanbul would prefer you forgot about that particular story. Anyway, see you next week. If you like these, click subscribe.